I got freaks nine days out of the week. I can give them. I was only yes. seven days in a week. Man, you ain't big pop. I'm the big bad booty daddy. It's nonstop. Now listen, English. And that, my friends, is exhibit A of why Scott Steiner is better than Kenny Omega in any other indie, smarky, AEW, whatever, NXT, or just anyone in WWE, to be honest. Any midget bastard. I mean, that promo alone, right, is just... I mean, you, you look at Kenny Omega, the guy is just a, a fucking geek that plays video games and, and does gymnastics, you know? He, he doesn't explode in barbed wire match, and it was the worst thing I've ever actually fucking seen in my entire life. See that ending? That is the worst pay-per-view ending I've ever seen in my life. I mean, Ben Walker came back and reenact that night in June 2007, man, and it would still go over better than that, you know? Big pop a pump. They get, give the guy a microphone, and it is golden, you know? There's very few people in the wrestling business, no, no matter what, when you give them a mic and it's just fucking comedy gold, you know? And this guy is one of them. People can slabber. I mean, how, how can... There's actually people out there that prefer the likes of Kenny Omega to Scott Steiner. I mean, what? What what the fuck is that all about, man? See this guy, every promo he cut in TNA, you know, WC, he didn't really cut them in WWE, but even the, the Iraq debate with... Uh, Christopher Nowanski, was it Christopher Nowanski? I mean, even that was comedy gold. You know, the guy is just brilliant. And fuck the smarks, fuck the indies. Good night, 2-1. That'll do it for Fog Out Wrestling. And I'm sure there'll be a, a bunch of AEW fanboys loving this one. But until next time, big pop a pump in the house. Holla, if you hear me.